हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज मिनी सेठी आई होप यू ऑल आर स्टेइंग हेल्दी टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट मीनिंग एंड सोर्सेज ऑफ प्राइमरी एंड सेकेंडरी डेटा सो व्हाट इज प्राइमरी डेटा प्राइमरी डेटा मींस ओरिजिनल डेटा व्हिच इज कलेक्टेड इन अ न्यू वे फॉर स्पेसिफिक पर्पस प्राइमरी डेटा मींस ओरिजिनल डेटा व्हिच इज कलेक्टेड इन अ न्यू वे फॉर स्पेसिफिक पर्पस वी कलेक्ट प्राइमरी डेटा एट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द मेन सोर्स फॉर एग्जांपल यू नीड इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट योर लोकेशन people or we can say that you want to collect data about your locality people which brand soap they mostly use and you directly go to each and every person and ask them which brand soap do you use here you need information about your locality people and you are directly asking from them means here you are collecting your data in new way here you are collecting your data starting from main source so it will call primary data now we are going to talk about secondary data secondary data are not original data or we can say the secondary data is collected by someone else earlier but you are simply using this data in your research secondary data is collected by someone else earlier but you are simply using this data in your research for example you want to get information about how mobile phone affect the development of child you will not go to each child or parents for taking this information you simply take some information from books some some information from internet some information from website some information from journal articles these data are not new someone else earlier collected this data and put it on internet and wrote on their books you simply use this data in your research so it will call secondary data so after knowing the meaning of primary and secondary data we will talk about sources of primary and secondary data firstly we are going to talk about sources of primary data first source of primary data is observation under observation method you will not directly ask anything to your respondent under observation method you will not directly ask anything to your respondent under this method you simply notice detail about something or someone by using your all senses under this method you will simply notice detail about something or someone by using your all senses for example you want to get information about why productivity of employee is reducing you will not directly ask anything from employees you will simply noticing them when they are working or we can say that you simply observe them when they are working so that you can know the cause of reducing productivity it will call observation method now we are going to talk on next source of primary data it will call interview method interview can be personal or telephonic in personal interview you are physically present and asking question to your respondent and assisting them to give answer in telephonic interview you simply asking question through phone now we are going to talk about next source of primary data it will call questionnaire under questionnaire method investigators have a list of questions which they use to gather data about attitudes experience and opinion of their respondent under questionnaire method investigators have a list of questions which they use to gather data about attitudes experience and opinions of their respondent For for example abc company want to know about customer feedback about their product they have list of questions uh, for example how satisfied are you with our uh, delivery how satisfied are you with our quality how do you rate our sales representative choose one number between 1 to 4 this list they will give to their customer and ask them please fill it so that they can know about customer feedback about their product it will call questionnaire method of collecting data now we are going to talk about next source of primary data it will call schedule method schedule method is similar to questionnaire it also consists list of questions but in this case uh, questions are filled by research workers or enumerators not by respondents now we are going to talk about source of secondary data what is secondary data secondary data is collected by someone else earlier you are simply using this data in your research and we can collect secondary data basically from two sources internal sources and external sources firstly we are going to talk about internal sources of collecting secondary data internal sources means you can find these sources inside your organization it's include your company record sales record financial record and employees record for example you want to get information why your market share is not increasing for many years you can get some information from your company record from your sales record from your financial 
financial record and from your employees record it will call internal source of collecting secondary data now we are going to talk about external source of collecting secondary data external sources mean take information from outside agencies it can be private agencies or government agencies or for example population research statistic can give you information about general population similar indian council of medical research can give you information about major diseases other external sources of secondary data are books magazines journal articles newspaper website or research report this is all about meaning and sources of primary and secondary data i think you got it and thank you so much for watching this video bye take care